Welcome back to the Dry Fire Journal. This is day 243, and this is incredibly difficult to film. Uh, I'm just trying to get my red dot through my phone camera. You won't be able to see it as I go from target to target, because in order for me to see it, it's gonna look like this, and you won't be able to see it very well. But here's what I want to show you. For today's drill, I want you to put two post-it notes up or use two targets. And what I want you to think about is as you transition, I'm just gonna simulate a dead trigger by just using my double action without any pressure. Can you work on transitioning flat from shot to shot without worrying, let me get where I can see that, from shot to shot without a dip or without a peak? The idea is you are going to press your shot and the gun's gonna recoil and you want to ride that straight to your next target. But just because the muzzle is rising doesn't mean the frame or the, the height of my hand needs to go up and down. So if I simulate recoil and bring that over as it falls to my next target, can I do that in both directions straight? This is really difficult to film, but you get the idea. Can I go from this or from this to just this? Now it is my support hand that is staying level between the two targets. If my support hand is doing its job, then the frame of the gun will stay level where I want it to be. So give this some thought. Give this some work. Let me know how it goes, and I will see you tomorrow.